Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Elizabeth. So today's video, we're doing a product review and it's on this right here. So it's the Diva Curl Super Stretch Coconut Curl Elongator. So I got this product at Ulta and it retails for $30. I know, pretty pricey, but that's the thing about reviews. You can watch them. If you guys want to spend your money, you always can. If not, thank you for watching my video. So let's go ahead, jump in and talk about what this product claims that it does. As always, Diva Curl products are 100% sulfate, paraffin, and silicone free. If you have super curly hair and want stretch curls without losing definition, this multi-use styler has your name all over it. Now, I don't really care if a product elongates my curls, curls, if a product elongates my curls or if I have shrinkage, I'm cool with it. I'm not expecting like crazy length with this product. I'm just looking for something that's going to help define my curls. That's it. But we're going to test it to see if it's going to elongate it because it does have that in the name of it. That's what it claims to do. So we're going to test that, but I'm not expecting it. All right. So it says, what does it do? This coconut infused cream stretches any style. It elongates curls without compromising definition while coconut oil delivers shine and moisture. The soft velvety texture gives the moisture of a cream with the hold of a gel without the crunch. So I already like that right there. I like something that's going to give me some good definition and hold without that crunchy feeling. So, cool. For an elongated wash and go, saturate curls by pressing super stretch into clean wet hair and a downward motion. Don't scrunch. For a stretch style, yes, we're talking twists, braids, bantu knots, etc. Apply on wet or damp curls and section style and unravel once dry. So my hair is pretty wet, as you guys can see. It's all over my shirt. Um, it's drying up, so I need to hurry up and process this. I'm not going to really saturate my hair too much. I don't like to do that because it's going to take forever to dry because I air dry. So this is the best that I'm going to do. It is drying up, but I don't care. So let's go ahead and see it. It does have like a, um, it says something had like a velvet texture. It does look like it. Looks like it has some bounce. Not too much bounce. Yeah, it does have some bounce. Looks like a, like a pillow. Okay. So this is all I'm going to take out. So it feels soft, but it looks like it has like some like clumps to it, kind of. Like it's not like completely like smooth all over the hands. Like it looks like it has some kind of clumpiness but it doesn't feel clumpy if you guys understand that it does have that coconut scent it does smell like the diva curl super cream so it has like a very coconut tropical scent which i don't mind but let's go ahead and apply it all throughout the hair it doesn't have like um some slip to it if you guys are expecting that it doesn't have a lot of slip And I don't want to apply so much because I feel like it might weigh the curls down for some reason. This is a little bit hard to like glide through the hair. It might just be for me, but I don't know. So this is all I'm going to apply to my hair right now. I'm going to go ahead and let it air dry. And then once it's completely air dried, I'll give you guys my first impression of this. So I'll see you guys in a little bit. So now that my hair is completely air dried, I can give you guys my first impression of this elongator cream right here. So as you guys can see, my hair is looking pretty voluminous, so I do like that. And I do notice that there's some good curl definition. Yeah, my hair does not look flat whatsoever. It is looking pretty big. And elongating, I'm not sure if I see that for first day hair. Maybe a little bit, but I wasn't really expecting that. My expectations are pretty low for the um, it being a curl elongator. I'm just looking for something that gives me good definition and volume and so far for first day hair. I am noticing that so those are pretty much my first impressions I want to keep today short to the point because I want to explain everything tomorrow so I'll see you guys for your day two super bright but let's start so today's gonna be the second and final day of me trying out this diva curl hair product so I could give you guys my overall thoughts so let's start with what this product claimed that it does and then I'll move on to my little hair checklist sounds good sounds good so in the front it says that it's going to define and control and it's a coconut curl elongator so the whole point is to elongate your hair stretch out your curls. Did I see that? Not really. I feel like my hair it looks the same. I feel like my hair looks longer because I'm like, wow, my hair is really growing out. But I don't think I don't it's from it's this product. product. I don't think it's because of this. I don't think so. Um, so me personally, I didn't really see any crazy inches. That's not what it's going to do. If you're going to do maybe a braid out or any other style, it might help with that aspect. But I don't really think it stretch out my curls. 
think my curls look pretty normal to me but um, I think it did provide really good definition so the fact that it says define and control I think that my curls look defined and in control so I think that's pretty much all it says in the bottle yeah this multi-use styler has a name all over it if you want stretch curls without losing definition yeah so that's pretty much the whole point elongating so let's go ahead and move on to my hair checklist and then we'll see what I look for in a curly hair product and if this is something that meets all the criteria Okay, so first thing on the list is ingredients. So this product, Diva Curl, always has no silicone, no sulfate, no parabens. I like that it has good stuff in it. Ingredients, not bad. Not bad. Now the price. So $30 is pretty, pretty pricey. But with this product, especially being $30, you really don't need a lot of it. As you guys can see, like I barely touched it because you don't really need a lot. So I feel like this would really stretch out, keyword, no pun intended, this would really stretch out um, with your bank, but $30 is pretty pricey, but you really don't need a lot. Hydration. So using this as a one and done, my hair does not feel dry whatsoever. It feels pretty hydrated. So now let's talk about curl definition. You guys should know that I love me some good curl definition, and this product did provide that. My hair is a little bit frizzy, but is still defined so as you guys can see I got some good curl definition going on and it's looking very voluminous so with that volume and that bigness in my hair it's prone to be a little bit frizzy so I don't mind the frizz just because for day two hair it looks pretty good the next on my checklist is how did it make my hair feel and how was it reapplying so applying this product was a little bit hard just because it didn't have like a lot of slip it wasn't like it was soft, but to apply to my hair, it was just a little bit difficult. Reapplying was easy. I don't notice any buildup. Um, I didn't really need a lot of hair product. I did refresh my hair with some water. And then I added a little bit of this to take care of any flyaways. But I feel like you don't really have to apply such a heavy hand day two or maybe even day three. Um, yeah, I didn't have to reapply a lot. Applying it was a little bit difficult, but still came out good. The last thing I want to talk about is the scent of it. So it does have a coconut tropical scent and it does linger so keep that in mind I do smell it I smell like the coconut scent but it doesn't really smell bad I do like the way it smells so I'm not really mad that it lingers but it does so that's pretty much everything I need to say about this Diva Curl product right here. I went over the claims and I went over my little hair checklist. So hopefully that helps you out if you're interested in this product. I hope that I went over some of the things that you look for in hair products. Now I want to know, have you guys tried this product out before? Do you guys want to? Uh, let me know your opinions. If there's any other products you want to see next for me to review, you can always leave a comment down below or you can tag me on Instagram. I'm always checking that and I'm always getting some good recommendations from you guys. Just let me know what's up. Let me know what product you want to see next from me. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.